What up, folks? Once again, it's your boy, Tim, and I'm going to start out by admitting this may not be my most popular video. However, for those of you who watch my nightly TikTok shows and, and where I interact with callers, you know that I am a big proponent of free speech. And this right here has me quite angry, and I'm going to say what I think needs to be said by as many Americans as possible. Comedian Dave Chappelle was scheduled yesterday to perform in Minneapolis, Minnesota in front of a sold out audience. Mere hours before coming to stage, the venue canceled his show. It turns out the LGBT community, due to Dave's controversial comedy over the past, had been protesting and demanding that the venue not entertain comedians like Dave Chappelle. And it appears that the comedian, that, that the venue, which is First Avenue, by the way, that is known for Purple Rain fame and the singer-songwriter Prince, decided to cave to the LGBT community and cancel an A-list comedian like Dave Chappelle. What's really crazy is First Avenue, known for Prince, was okay with stuff like this in the 1980s, but a guy walking around on stage telling jokes in 2022 has become unacceptable? Are we out of our freaking minds? Anyhow, here is the statement that was released from First Avenue as to why they canceled Dave Chappelle's show. The Dave Chappelle show tonight at First Avenue has been canceled and is moving to the Varsity Theater. To staff, artists, and our community, we hear you and we are sorry. We know we must hold ourselves to the highest standards and we know we let you down. We are not just a black box with people in it and we understand that First Avenue is not just a room but meaningful beyond our walls. The First Avenue team and you have worked hard to make our venue the safest spaces in the country and we will continue with that mission. We believe in diverse voices and the freedom of artistic expression, but in honoring that, we lost sight of the impact this would have. We know there are some who would not agree with this decision. You are welcome to send feedback. Well, here's my feedback right here. I'm a huge Dave Chappelle fan. My feedback is right there. I'm just gonna say this. How can you claim to be in favor of artistic expression, but stop a comedian from performing his act? What group among us is so high and mighty that they are above reproach that you cannot do something as simple as tell jokes about that group? How many white people are the butt of jokes from black comedians all over the country? If you go see a black comedy show, the chances of hearing jokes about white people would have to probably be 90% or higher. But yet you don't see any of this coming from that community. I just cannot understand how walking around on stage telling jokes has become unacceptable, but this or this is now considered as normal. Have we lost our freaking minds? You have the right to love who you want, to marry who you want, to be who you are, but that should not give you the right to then, the, to then turn around and stop someone else, like a comedian, from being who they are. If you want freedom of expression, you should have it as well. I really hate to even have to come on here and do a video like this. I understand it might be unpopular to some, but the woke generation and the cancel culture we're dealing with now has become insane to the point where a comedian cannot tell jokes about a specific community because that community gets hurt and they don't want other folks to laugh at those jokes. The LGBT community, had they let Dave Chappelle do his material, this would have come and went. But every time they make a spectacle over Dave Chappelle. And make no mistake about it, the story I'm talking about right now is national news. It's all over CNN and Fox, et cetera, et cetera. Every time they do this, they give Dave Chappelle material, a Netflix special, and an entire tour. He left First Avenue that night, 
last night when they canceled his show, he left First Avenue. He went to the Varsity Theater. And guess what his material consisted of? Making fun of those protesters. So just want to say that, that you're not silencing Dave, Dave Chappelle. You're actually giving him material to ridicule your asses further. That is the only point I'm trying to make. Love who you want. Be who you want to be. But do not turn around and oppress others for doing the same thing. It's your boy, Tim, the handsome liberal. Whatever you guys want to say about me, I'm finding entertain that in the comments. But this one really pissed me off. So I figured I'd get on here and talk to you.